Hi, it's Jane. I'm down here at the Allotment Community Garden, which I've been working on this year with British Garden Centres. And this week we are celebrating National Allotment Week, which is running from the 7th until the 13th of August. Now, it's really appropriate that I'm at a community allotment garden because this year's focus is all about sharing. So what better place to be than at a community garden? During the pandemic, we were all encouraged to get outside into growing spaces. And there was a number of reasons for this. It was for our mental well-being, being present in the moment, physical activity, making connections, learning new skills, as well as connecting with other people. So community allotment spaces are really important because they actually do just about all of these things. However, since the pandemic, we also have to be aware that people are still struggling. We are facing a cost of living crisis where people are struggling to actually have enough to eat. So something like a community allotment garden enables you to grow food specifically to give to those who are in need. However, there is also something else, which is if you're not involved in a community allotment garden, is if you have lots of surplus, you can equally find a group near to you and donate that to them as well. Now, the absolute beauty of working with a community group is if you have not got the skills yet and you're a bit worried about how you're going to grow your own, actually working with other people enables you to gain those skills. There's always people who are available to ask questions, whether it's in person or actually there's a really friendly online community as well. So remember, even if you are new to allotmenting or you've been doing it for a very long time, a shared harvest actually goes a really, really long way.